Hi, are you Anne? Yes, I'm Anne. Hi, I'm Karen McIntosh. I'm a rehabilitation therapy assistant student from SAIT. And your physiotherapist has asked me to come and do some measurements and some um, reviewing of your exercises. Oh, okay. All right. Can I just check to make sure I've got the right Anne? So can you spell your last name for me? C-H-O-V-E-Y. All right. And your birth date is? July 19, 55. Okay, great. Thanks, Anne. So um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to measure the, your ankle with the goniometer. You've used those before with your physiotherapist, Nancy, right? Right, I've seen that before, yes. Okay, so I'm going to measure your ankle first, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to have you show me the exercises that you've been doing at home. Okay. And I'm going to do a stretch on your ankle after that. All right. All right, and then I'll measure your ankle again. Okay. All right, I'm going to do all of this before you see the physiotherapist, just okay. so everything is ready for her. Now, um, do you have any questions about what we're going to be doing together? No, but is it going to hurt? No, it's not going to hurt. Because my pain level is about 3 out of a 10 right now. Okay, and is that the same level of pain that you've been having, or is it going up and down a lot? It's about the same. It's about the same. And where exactly is the pain? Right here. Right there, okay. I'm just going to write that down just to make sure I don't forget. Okay. All right. Good. So um, what I'm going to do first then is do your measurements. And so what I'm only going to do is I will get you a pillow and have you lying down on this bed with your head up at that end. All right. So we'll just have you sit over here and I'm going to go get that pillow for you. Lying down on your back, please. I'm just going to bring the bed up a little bit just so it's easier for me to measure the movement and do things with you. Okay. okay. And honest, it will stop before we get to the ceiling. All right. All right. Okay, good. So I'm just going to measure first. And like I said, I'm just going to measure this ankle here. And I'm just going to draw a little bit on your leg. Is that all right? Yeah. This just makes sure that I'm able to keep the... It's easier to visualize where the lines are as you do your movement. Okay? So... All right, I'm going to ask you to pull your toes towards you. That's it. A little bit more, a little bit more, a little bit more. That's as far as it'll go. Okay, good. And relax. Now, did that hurt at all? Uh, no. No. So the pain's still at three. It didn't make it worse. Correct. Okay. So that was about five degrees. Okay. Now, that's one of the reasons why you're limping is because that's a little bit stiff, and so that's what these exercises are to do, is to make it easier for you to pull up. Oh, okay. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I am going to ask you to do your ankle pumps to begin with. So you're just pulling that you're doing at home, pushing and like that. Okay. You're doing that one at home? Yes, I am. How often? Three times a day. Three times a day. And how many times do you do it each time? Ten. Ten. Good. Well, keep on doing it. I want to make sure that you're going through your full range. So does this bother your heel or your ankle at all when you're doing it like this? No, but that's, that's as far as it'll go. Okay. Sometimes if you have a little bit of a rolled up towel, okay, and then that way there's less pressure on your heel. Is that a little bit easier to yeah, do? Yeah, it is actually. Okay. Well, why don't you try that at home? Okay. Because okay. if it, the exercise is easy to do, it, you're more likely to do it more often and get it looser. Okay. Okay. Good. So you can try that at home. All right. All right. Now, you did also a uh, stretch in standing, didn't you? Where you leaned forward? Yeah, I did. Okay. Can you show me that? Let me just bring the bed back down. I don't want you to have to hurt yourself by leaping off. Okay. 
Okay, and I'm going to have you do it right here. I'm just going to move the chair a little bit so it's easier for you to do it. Okay, so did she ask you to do it against a wall or something? Or in, in just in the open area here? I don't remember. Okay, so let me show you. That. Okay, so if you lean against here, and then you've got your sore leg behind, and what you can do is you reach back and you try to push your heel down to the ground like that. Oh, okay. Okay, so try that. Go well, I obviously wasn't doing it right. Okay, so you can lean against the wall, so you can lean on your elbows. Can you feel that stretch? Oh, yeah. Where's that, in here or yes, here? totally in my, in my calf. Okay, good. Because that's where we want you to, to, to feel it. Because when you've been in the cast the way you have, it, it gets really tight in those areas. Now, how long have you been usually holding this stretch? About 10 seconds. 10 seconds, okay, good. And how many have you done of those? Five. Five, okay. Just go ahead and do five, just so we can make sure that you're doing them well. And that looks good. Oh yeah, that ha that, that's what happens when you break things. No, I mean it's seriously tight. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So if I don't do the other leg, will I be unbalanced? Um, no, not necessarily. Um, but a lot of times we, we suggest that you, you do them on both sides because that way you can have a feel of how, what you should be feeling and so you know how it should feel. Okay, so just lying down on your back again. So I'm gonna lift you back up. I'm gonna do a stretch now. So I'm, again, we're gonna make it stretch in that area, but I'm gonna have your leg against my arm. Okay. Okay. So I'm just gonna ask you to come a little bit closer to this edge, just so I'm not stressed. Okay, so I'm gonna pull and you're gonna feel, so I'm gonna lean towards you like All this. Right. Okay, now it's, it shouldn't hurt and you let me know if I'm going too far. Okay, just feel stretchy. All right. Okay, I'm gonna, again, I'm gonna hold it for about 10 seconds the way you were doing it. All right, all right, so, No, 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 no. That is that too too much? No, I, I am just saying I can feel it. Okay, but it's not no. making it's no, it's not, not affecting your pain at all. No, it's not. Okay, good. Okay, I'm gonna do three of these. Okay. Same kind of stretch? Yep. Is it the same stretch in the same place as when you do the standing one? It is. Good, good, that's what we want. As you get more mobile, we'll add more different kinds of stretches, but right now, this will help you be able to walk a little bit better with less of a limp if we get this movement a little okay, bit Okay, that's about as far as I can take of that. Okay, <laughs> good. Okay, so that was three. All right. And so I'm going to measure this again. And we'll see if there's any change with us doing all those exercises. Don't have to draw on you again because I still have those dots. Okay. Can you pull your toes up towards? Pull, 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 pull. Good, okay, so that's about 10 degrees. That's a little bit better. Excellent. All right, so you just need to make sure you continue doing those, those stretches. And you remember how to do the one against the wall now? Yes, I do. Can you just repeat on how you're gonna do that? I'm gonna lean against the wall and put my affected leg back and hold it for 10 seconds. Good, excellent. And the ankle pumps, how, are you, how, how did we talk about changing that one? Uh, okay, I'm remember not sure. I asked you to put a towel, rolled up towel underneath your right. knee? 
because it made it feel more comfortable when you were doing it. That's right. Okay. Yes, I will. I all will right. Do that. Good. So that's all I'm going to do with you today. Um, I'm going to go get your physiotherapist, and she's going to do the treatments that she was going to do on you. Okay. Okay. So are you comfortable? Yes, I am. Okay. I'll be right back with your physiotherapist. Okay. Thank you. Okay.